Hello, turkey mama. Okay, guys, welcome to the chicken coop. Today I'm doing an update on my problem with the mites. Turns out they're not mites after all. That's a motorbike. They're called stick fast fleas. Now I have to think everybody who went out of their way for to uh, give me suggestions, real information. Even though that video didn't have any comments on it, I still uh, still got some good information, useful information, suggestions, and you know, actually know what the bug is called. When you actually know what the problem is, it's a lot easier to treat it. Because you think it's one thing, don't mean that that's what it is. You know, I thought it was uh, mites, which are a nasty little bug. I did research fleas before. But the pictures didn't look anything like the bugs I have because I was looking at the wrong kind of fleas. Uh, I thought fleas because the cat got it. You see the chicken with one leg there? I was worried or with the with the bad leg. I was worried about him. Turns out he can run fast faster than uh, than the other ones. I think he's gonna have one super leg. He's having no problems uh, getting around and taking care of himself. Oh, bug, bug. I see the bug too. Now everybody's in there. You see that? Uh, Mama Turkey's out with her baby ducks. The strange thing with these bugs, you know, I've had them on a quail, turkeys, chickens, but never ducks. So the update is I tried a bunch of stuff. I, it was suggested I try tweezers. I did that actually before the suggestion. Very painful. Uh, it was working, but like I say, very painful for the bird. It's been about a week, I guess, since that video went up. Uh, the, the baby turkey is physically bigger. You can see he's grown. I'm hoping it's a girl. I really, I'm hoping this turkey is a girl. I don't need another pet tom turkey, that's for sure. Uh, <laughs> but my luck. And I got a fun, funny, funny suspicion it's going to be a dude. Anyway, I tried the tweezers. It works, but painful. Another suggestion uh, was mineral oil. The idea with mineral oil is you suffocate the bugs. It sticks to them. They can't breathe. They die. Uh, I couldn't find mineral oil here, but when I was researching it, I found out that baby oil is mineral oil with perfume in it. So I was going to use that. We didn't have any. And uh, as I'm researching this, I get another suggestion of Vaseline. Vaseline we had. Vaseline is basically mineral oil. It's, they're both a byproduct of the petroleum industry. And we have it. The good thing about Vaseline is it's not an oil that's going to run away. It'll basically stay where you put it. So that's good. And I tried that and it's working. Now here's what the baby looked like one week ago absolutely covered you know or I've actually seen it worse but uh, and there's a lot of bugs you know hundreds and hundreds of little bugs in there and these are very painful I know when they bite me it hurts so now we'll get the get the baby out I'm open to uh, release her in with the general population today her I'm really open it's a girl <laughs> Okay, here she is. Get her out. Here's what she looks like now. You see the top of her head around right here? That's where I was using the tweezers. I actually did a bunch on the bottom too. You see that? There's still a few bugs on her. Right around the high. I don't know. They might be dead. I think they are dead. And under here... Come on, baby. Oh, there we go. Right under here. There used to be a lot. Yesterday there was a lot there. They were coming back. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Relax, relax, relax. But for the most part, they're gone. What? <laughs> we got a runner. Ah, uh, this is not no magic cure. 
because you know this place is full of those little eggs from the fleas but uh, boy one one day 12 hours and pretty much cleared them up I have given her uh, more Vaseline because they are coming they come back you know like I said there's still some in here for whatever reason this is the only bird in here that has them she sleeps with her mom uh, mom don't have any so how I do this or how I've done it so I take my Vaseline now this Vaseline it's so hot here that it's nearly liquefied anyway I put a big glob right there so I don't have to st keep sticking my finger in the bottle you see it's running away it's it's so hot you know welcome to Thailand Come on, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it'll be good. Your neck is a lot longer now. Just give her a good, a good coat over the area where, where they come from, or where they're normally at. All around the eyes, That's, they're always around the eyes. Any of the bad areas. Now she don't like this. But a little bit of unpleasantness is better than death, which will happen if this goes untreated. Come on, don't move. We'll cover you up. There we go. There she is. Now I'm going to let her go in with the other birds today. I think it's time and tomorrow I will put more Vaseline until I don't see any sign of any more bugs on her. There you go, good luck. Good luck. Well, go. There she is. Like I say, I'm open she. <laughs> I am open she, but I don't think so. If mama would come out, the door's open mama, come on. Don't know what to make of this place. They got food everywhere, don't they? Look at that, huh? Come on, mama. Everybody's coming to see. Who are you? It's like they're from a different world, you know? It's just separated by a piece of plastic. <laughs> Mesh plastic at that. Uh, this baby is at a very, very tough start to life, that's for sure. These bugs are nasty. I know they bite me. It is very painful. Not a not a pleasant situation at all. Hello, big mama. How you doing? Huh? What's up? So having that many bugs constantly sucking your blood out 24 hours a day, not a pleasant situation. You gonna go inside? Huh? You wanna go in there? The chicken's gonna go in. Now I can fix the broken door, I get them out of there. Look at that. I want the turkey to come out, but instead a different turkey is going in. What do you think's in there? You want your babies to come in? Yeah? Babies are busy. Taking it easy. So I need to thank everybody that sent suggestions went out of your way to find <laughs> a way to send me suggestions and ideas and actually naming the bug. That's a very big help. When you actually know what it is, it's a lot easier to treat the problem. You can actually research it then. These, these little fleas, they're nasty. And I've had them before. I always thought it was red mites. 
but uh, they're not. And and like I said, this Vaseline, it works. It does a good job, but it's it's not going to cure the problem. There's still eggs. There's going to be eggs hatching again, like up until this this turkey got bugs I thought I had it pretty much cured and then they hit with a bang all of a sudden both my dogs are full of are full of them and uh, the dogs is, and the cat very easy to get off we have a powder that uh, you just mix it into their fur wipe it, wipe it in and in one day they were all gone that powder did not work on the birds at all so yeah anyone who went out of their way to uh, give me the answers I need and sorry about no comments on these type of videos but I tell you uh, you get multiple death threats in a day because you're doing something that people don't understand it gets a little frustrating oh turkey mama and turkey mama gonna fight what's with that turkeys so they fight too don't you worry people against chicken fighting you know cock fights yeah a cock fight to the death is not a very nice thing but uh, just a regular old cock fight is normal if you've ever had two chickens they don't even have to be males you you know what I'm talking about they fight it's what they do dominance has to be proven so yeah I have a video now that's just gotten popular the last couple days it got about 70,000 views in 24 hours, so quite a lot of views. And the hate that's coming out of there, you know, been threatened with death multiple times, you know, and called an idiot and stupid, and it just goes on and on and on. <clears throat> because I let a chicken hatch duck eggs. That's all it was. It's a cute video. It's mama chicken with, uh, with some baby ducks. It's very cute, you know, baby ducks are very cute, but here I am, a horrible, horrible person for, for doing something like that, <laughs> you know, it is ridiculous. Uh, so many people have no idea what they're talking about, but they're not afraid to threaten you with death, you know, and I know it's just idiots being idiots I know that but it gets frustrating and uh, like I say for a long time I didn't even make any videos about this stuff for that reason because it get it just went way too far and now I do it same with the fish videos no comments on those it's just too much man it's just too much you know one morning I checked my email and I was called an idiot 12 times and had one death threat that is the day that was that was enough you know uh, I know most people have this most people don't read their comments so it don't matter they don't care I uh, hate brings more views there's no doubt about that but you know I'm not in this for views I'm in this because it's a hobby it helps people I've had multiple people in the last week uh, tell me the same thing I've asked many different people the same question and nobody won't even answer me you know maybe it's because my English is not very good but I have this problem can you tell me what to do and they're beyond thankful when I reply to them and tell them what I think if I know the answer or have a suggestion I don't always have the answer and uh, that's why I do it I help normal people you know and that's that's all I get out of it is you know is the the pleasure of helping somebody but having to deal with these idiots every day just too much too much too much I tell you what maybe one day I'll let the, put the comments back on these type videos but as of right now if there's a problem if I'm showing something that's you know normal people don't show like I said in the original video showing this baby with the bugs nobody shows this because this is not pretty but it's real life and it happens to everybody if you've ever raised any animals you know that stuff happens you know 
There's a reason there's a vet down the road from everybody. <laughs> you know, because animals have problems just like us. I'm going to get Mama Turkey out of there and that baby chicken. And we'll end this video and stop complaining. Alright guys, like I said, thank you big time to everybody who sent, su sent suggestions. Look at that. Baby ducks all in a row. Oh, I'm going to say there should be another one. There he comes. <laughs> Alright guys, as always, thanks for watching. I need to get old mama out of there. She really wants out, but she's too scared to take the jump, I think. Come on, mama. Come on. Now don't you two fight, huh? There's plenty of babies to share. You don't need to fight over them. <laughs>